Uh, every day, come on out. Uh, different types of sandals. Glasses. Different colors. Okay. If anything, I can get a a hat to match this. Uh, Hmm, gray, black, gray, black, gray, black. Oh, white, I guess. One gray, gray on the back. Hmm. I think the gray, the white one here. Ah, uh, yes. Thanks. I guess we can look at that uh, shaman kimono. So kimonos go in the shirt category. Whoa. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Pants can stay old. Man, she's gonna be so impressed. She's gonna give me a whole star. You have progressed to a. Uh, if you have progress to report, I will judge its worthiness. Show me your Pokedex. Open. Uh. Oh. Oh. Email? I guess this would be easier to tell. Tell. They look the same. Okay, males have two things on their back, two little spots. Females only have the one. Okay. Um, am I supposed to be doing something like checking off some stuff? What what's going on here? Just bring it up for me to look at. Hmm. You have made progress. It seems you have earned yourself a star. With this, you have officially obtained the rank of first star in the Galaxy Expedition Team. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's ten of them. You can now use heavy balls. Pokemon up to level twenty will obey your orders reliably, uh, reliably in battle. The rewards you earn uh, for your Survey Corps reports will be more generous now too. Have these as well. They are further recipes you'll need for crafting. Okay, recipe for heavy balls, an abricone, and a black tumble stone. Revives, cool. A vivid choke and two medicinal leaks. And that's a uh, that a stranger like you should fall from the sky, and yet flourish among us like uh, like this is a testament to your native talent and hard work. Most people prefer uh, prefer when things are simple enough to be judged on face value alone. 
and proving your worth uh, by moving up through our ranks is something uh, anyone can understand. Keep at it, and even if you did fall from the sky, people may be more willing to accept you. Uh, working your way through the ranks will also be a help if you wish to make a lot, uh, if you wish to make a life for yourself here. A higher, a higher rank will grant you access to more types of Pokeballs and greater rewards. Cool. For today, at least, you've earned yourself a meal at the Wallflower and a good night's rest. Thank you, Captain. So, Brian, my boy, I believe a jolly good congratulations is in order. Well done on earning your first star rank. The potato mochi tastes so much better when you've had something to be happy about. Still, we'll be very busy from now on between our survey court duties and requests from folk here. Which reminds me, have you already taken the request from Beauregard? I sure have. The people of Jubilife aren't too familiar with Pokemon, you see? So if problems arise, the Survey Corps gets, to call, uh, gets called to help. Indeed so. Some people will ask, uh, will ask you when you talk with them, while others will need to be claimed from the blackboard I keep in my lab. Speaking of which, weren't you approached with a request recently, Akari? What's it all about? About that, I was thinking maybe Brian can handle it for me. I was told it would require a bit of skill with battling Pokemon, so... Hmm, yes. A request came from Mai of the Diamond Clan, if I recall correctly. The people of the Diamond Clan have lived here in Hisui since the before Galaxy Team arrived. If we could establish good relations, I'm sure there is much we might learn from them. Uh, of the local Pokemon, uh, but we can discuss all that tomorrow. For today, we should eat up and get some rest. I gotta let me go talk to those people. I have to talk to them the next day. Great, awesome. How do I get that worm pull out from? Listen, do you have a bit of time after this? There's something I could use your help with. Um, alright. Thank you, I'll be waiting for you at the training grounds then. If you've caught a lot of Pokemon, you may want to visit the pastures to change up your team. Thank you. Oh, is that a haircut place? Oh, what can I help you with today? Here's time. Oh, you just took it. I can't check before you take my money. this look like? Okay, <laughs> good. <laughs> Show me. Braids. Well, that's kind of how my hair is right now, yeah. And it's black. What's this? What? <laughs> What's going on here? Oh, my eyebrow. Oh. Wow. The black is good. Okay. Yeah, come from. Um, how do I? Oh, X. Yeah, it's like that. I don't know how you got me to get more hair, but thank you. They're all done now. Why, you look simply wonderful. Uh, fetch your hat for you to wear? Yeah, I'll wear it. There we go. Cool. Uh, hold on. Can I just... Give Beauregard 
the wormhole if it's in the pasture or do I have to have it on me? Yeah, okay, you're good. Um Hmm. Yes. Ooh. I have no idea what the circles on the right, but uh, the circles on the right mean. But this one seems the stinkiest, the most stinky loser I have. So you can have that one. <laughs> there you go. Yes. You really brought me one. You must be as good as the rumors say. I'd like to name this Wormpole right away. Now that I've been told a Wormpole will evolve into a Pokemon known as Beautiful Eyes, should I give it a name with that in mind? Hmm, well, <laughs> it might not be a Beautiful Eye. Hmm, this is a tough decision. <laughs> which, uh, which of these do you like best? Beauticia? Uh, Butifred or Buagene? Uh, I think I like Butisha. <laughs> yeah, I like Butisha too. I guess that's decided then. I'll raise Butisha to be Splendiferous. Uh, a Splendiferous Beautifly. Wait and see. <coughs> Dazzling honey. The fuck is that? And... Was it you? Yeah, the Starly. Uh huh. Please let me see the Starly entry in that Pokedex. Once you've. Oh, complete it like I'm. Okay. In its entirety. That would be a bit. Wait, I never had talked to that guard over there, didn't I? Fuck. Crash is home. Uh, uh, yep. Change my party. Okay. Hmm. He's only got one in HP. He got two. Hmm. Hold on. Two, one, one. Wow. Quick. Okay. Move. Attack and some special attack, but your speed is lower. Go with you. Uh. Three. Let's get you. Well, the two only, but that's fine. Of the shinxes I have, what are we looking at? Two, two, three. Okay, Mr. Two, two, three, get in here. Um. I guess we'll get a worm pull in here because we gotta see it use a uh, poison sting and evolve some. I got no boizels in yet, but that's alright. We'll get to you eventually. And we don't have any EVs in, but we'll get to them. Uh, yep, thank you. So let's go get that request from that guard real quick. Totally forgot. I went looking for other requests. I was like, yeah, I'll come back. Once I know there's not other people. Can Pokemon of the same species really come in different sizes? I know the professor said they do, but I'll have a hard time believing it unless I see a different sized one lined up side by side. If there's really, if there really are bi uh, Buizel's bigger than mine, I'd love to see them alongside the one I have. For comparison's sake. 
I think I have a big boy, Boizel. Oh, you're a natural when it comes to catching Pokemon, right? I bet you see where I'm going with this. If you catch a Boizel bigger than mine, would you let me have it? Uh, I'll make it worth your while. Big Boizel, little Boizel. Have you brought a bigger Boizel? Uh, how do I check if they're big or not? You know? <laughs> Mm, I don't see anything that, like, lets me know. <laughs> it's in summer? Night? 111. 2 1. Two seven. This is six point four. Five point three. Okay. Two three. Two forty six. So you're my biggest boy, huh? Two seven. Sixty six point four pounds. Yeah, whatever. Good gravy, I never expected you to bring one so quickly. <laughs> I'm afraid I'm looking for one that's bigger than 2-8. Okay. 2-8, eight, 2-8. Eight. I have to remember that. It's rather impressive that you get so close to Pokemon while they're firing attacks at you. Oh, I bet you're skilled at dodging. I haven't really used it that much. Uh. 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 Oh, right, I got, um, honey, dazzling honey, honey that sparkles with an amber hue. It, it is beloved by bug Pokemon and Pokemon with fairy-like charms. So they will gather wherever a comb is, a uh, comb of it is thrown. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Thanks for coming. I know you're busy. Listen, I had an epiphany. Uh, is everything all right? You see, I've got a partner of my own. We may not get along perfectly, but we've got to work together to help complete the Pokedex. You have a Pokemon? Yes, here it is. This is my partner, Pikachu. <laughs> Big guy. When we were attacked by the Shanks, I got too scared to think straight, and I couldn't handle battling as a team. Ever since then, my partner... <laughs> My partners refuse to listen to anything I tell them. And if I'm being honest, I'm not sure... I'm not even sure how to order him. How to guide him in battle. The guy. But when I saw how you and your Pokemon work together, I realized we needed to do more too. So please, have a battle with me. I want to learn how to fight effectively. Okay. Another one Pikachu. I'm a level two beater. <laughs> Jeez. My poor little Bidu. He's not ready for this fight. Oh, my Starly's gonna. They're both gonna get wrecked out there, but. Ah, sure, well, that's level 10. Ugh. God damn. Strong! Nice. 
It's all right, Oshawott. You did the damage. decided you and your Pokemon seem to complete uh, seem to be completely in step with one another oh poor Oshawa <laughs> new move new move phew thank you for battling us I could be wrong but for a moment I felt like Pikachu and I finally understood one another let's keep working at it okay Pikachu Why is the cry so short? <laughs> Big guy. I guess I was wrong then. But I'll strive to work more as a team with my partner. The way you do. Assuming Pikachu and I can bridge some gaps. Oh, by the way, the professor said Pokemon have these things called types, which apparently makes a big difference in how battling goes. Pikachu seems to be an electric type, for example. Oh wow, you gave me a fucking, a whole, uh, <laughs> type chart. Both Pokemon and moves have types. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah. Uh, so you're the one, the new recruit everyone's talking about. I'm Zisu, captain of the security corps. I see you've got some fight in you. Figured I'd stop by and give what advice I could. Captain Zisu is a master of ancient martial arts, one that specializes in Pokemon battles. Now listen, uh, now listen. If your Pokemon truly mastered its moves, it can use uh, it can actually use them in different styles. Uh, on one hand, you can choose to deliver a move in the strong style. The move will deal more damage, but afterwards it'll take it'll take longer for your Pokemon to act. On the other hand, if you choose to unleash a move in the Agile style, such a move will have less power behind it, but your Pokemon will act more quickly afterwards. In truly favorable conditions, you might get to... You might get out two moves before your opponent uh, can act. Strong style moves, Agile style moves, and of course, regular moves. Which, uh, choose which is right for a given situation, and direct your Pokemon with a little nudge. Yep, I just use strong style. Yep. The strong style boosts power of the move, lowers the user's action speed, uses more PP than usual. Agile reduces the power of the move, raises the user's action speed, and uses more PP than usual. <coughs> also, one more thing. If you want to teach your Pokemon some uh, some powerful moves, let me know. Zisu's teachings should serve you well when you're up against tough Pokemon. Now, I suppose it's time I went and met Mai. You remember? I mentioned that the Wallflower, that I could use your help and with Mai's request? I'm to meet her down past the foot of Aspiration Hill. You should come as well once you've readied your Pokemon team, and perhaps uh, had them learn some new moves from Zisu, if you'd like. All right, what do you got? I hand the training ground, your Pokemon get master new moves, learn new moves, okay. Uh, exchange items. Grit gravel, grit pebble, I have no idea what these are. I've got a question. Effort valley, oh wow, effort levels. Raising your Pokemon's effort levels will improve their stats, you see? You can use items like Grit Dust to raise your Pokemon's stats, like attack and, or defense, or what have you. Uh, it might give you the edge in battle. Uh, you need a battle. Huh, okay. Uh, I want to master moves. And help you master moves. If you want, you need... Yeah, if you don't have a seat of mastery. Uh, I want new moves. I don't know, Oshawott. 
you could learn false swipe, rock smash, aerial lace, focus energy, rest. Uh, false swipe could be good to not knock out motherfuckers. There you go. Cool. Uh, I don't know. Let's see what Ponyta can get. Swift and Rest. Okay. Bidoof, what do you got? Uh, Stealth Rock. Rock Smash, Swift, Rest. Shinx. Fire Fang. Thunder Fang. Ice Fang. Swift. Rest. Baby Doll Eyes. Uh. Uh, let's get you Thunderfang for a nice stab move. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, Wormpole. Let's see what you can learn. Nothing. <laughs> Great. Starly, what you got? Swift Ominous Wind. Huh. And rest. Interesting that you can learn Ominous Wind. Uh, bulk up, rock smash, swift, rest. And Eevee, what can you learn? Swift, focus, energy, calm mind, rest, and baby doll eyes. It'll need baby doll eyes for uh, going into Sylveon. That's how it evolves. Needs a fairy move and. It's needs to use a fairy move and it's in a battle like be max happiness wait is it has happened no it probably doesn't like I forgot I'll have to look it up I know it's it has to use a use or have a fairy type move uh, here's a photography studio you can enjoy taking photographs together with your Pokemon Ever consider preserving a lovely memory with your Pokemon as a photograph? Come on in and give it a try. Sure. We're here. Why not? I'm in the business of photographing folk with their Pokemon. Why don't you have your uh, photo taken? Okay. Thank you, old man. Take a photo. Uh, change your pose. Um, do I have to actually, like, turn myself facing this way? Thumbs up. Uh, at the ready. Brace for battle. Over the shoulder. Uh, hero pose. Uh, sitting plainly. <laughs> sitting confidently. Next. Okay. Um. Uh, can I put like Oshawa right below it? Oh, I'm right below my hand. Like I'm presenting him. Jesus. What's the smile? <laughs> Surprised. Troubled. Angry. Serious. Vacant. Thinking. Neutral. Okay. Smile. Just give it a nice smile. Uh, back. Uh. I want to put my Pokemon and press the capture button. Okay. Nice. Great. Thank you. Uh, can I put a fucking Pokemon in here? No. He said he said he's in the business of taking pictures of people and their Pokemon. What the fuck? Lying old fuck? <laughs> Okay, there we go. I have to talk then. Uh, 
Yeah, it's just me and Oshawa right now. Change the screen. Pink, blue, red, uh, light green, purple? Nice. Gray, orange. Uh. Okay. Uh, take photos. Change your pose. And <laughs> that's fierce. <laughs> Look happy. And I go to sleep. <laughs> Act dizzy. Pretend to faint. Try to get that right there. Damn it. I think I got it there. <laughs> nice. Yeah, okay. Now right, let's get out of here.